going on guys um over here with my 05 bmw 325 ci um got the wheel off as you can see this damn tire keeps on leaking i plugged it about uh, about a couple weeks ago and she's leaking again so yeah there's that uh we're gonna i'm gonna show you real quick how to fix the plug it keeps leaking i'm gonna show you how to diagnose make sure that you can tell that it's leaking figure out where the leak's coming from so what you're gonna need first you're gonna need a bottle of soapy water easy check this out see this that's the old plug spray it with some water look for the bubbles see all them bad boys that's no good. Losing there. So we got we got to pull that plug out and uh, figure that out. So hang tight with me. I'm gonna show you the live action real quick. All right, <laughs> it's not hard. Anybody can do it. Save you from buying. We'll be a hundred fifty dollar tire right here, and you can pick up one of these kits. Easy. You got your reamer, got your plug with your needle, easy. Also comes with some rubber cement, check that out, gotta have it, gotta have it. Don't use it without it, man. That's what I did on this one. I didn't use the rubber cement and here we are, look at this shit, doing it all over again. So, I'm gonna try to set y'all up real quick somewhere. So you can see what's going on, and I can have both hands. Hang tight. What we're gonna do is just push her through. Take your reamer. Push her in there. All right. Now she's hissing. Grab your rubber cement. Pop that guy open. Put just some rubber cement on your reamer. Put it in the hole. Get that stuff everywhere. It's alright if the air comes out. I'm gonna hold that guy there. I'm gonna put some rubber cement. On our plug. Be, be generous with the stuff. Alright. We're going to take our reamer out. After we make sure we get this nice and reamed real good. We want to create a good surface for our plug to stick to. We'll make sure it goes all the way through this handle. Alright, I think that's plenty good. Alright, as I pull it out, I'm going to go ahead and stick this plug in. With a turning motion. You want to twist to the right. Right or left, it doesn't matter, just go one way. Alright. You see our plug's getting in there. Go in to the plug's most of the way in. Alright, you see that? Alright. All you gotta do, take it like that, turn it a little bit. We'll go in just a little more. Trying to get it as good as we can, so we're gonna do this again. Alright, turn it, and yank. Boom. There you go. Get a good view of that. All right, we're just gonna trim that up, and then we're good to go. I'm gonna check the leaks real quick. Before we do that, we'll spray it with our bottle. Check for air bubbles. All right, so far so good. Don't see any. I get some really soapy water on that. All 
that's it. That's all there is to it. Save you from buying a $300 tire. Look at that real quick. Alright. I'm going to trim this up and we'll be done. You just want to trim it right down to where it almost meets your tire. You leave a little bit hanging out. It'll come right off when you go driving down the road. This rubber cement's really sticky stuff. Let me grab some side cutters. Trust the old side cutters always do the trick. Just come in here, snip, snip. Uh huh. Some strong plugs. These are premium plugs, by the way. The first one I had was a standard plug, so hopefully this one does the trick. We'll see. I will update y'all in a couple weeks when I know for sure she ain't leaking. There we go. And that's how you plug a tire. Check that bad boy out. Mm-hmm. Yeah, nothing to it. I'm gonna hit her with the spray bottle one more time just to be safe. Alright, let's see. I don't see any bubbles coming out, so I think we're good, guys. If this helped y'all, uh, please like, subscribe to my video, and I'll see y'all in the next one.